Chemicals are all around us. In the food we eat, the clothes we wear, in the products we use every day. Chemicals can help us live better lives, but if we don't understand about the chemicals we use, they can harm us. This program is designed to help you understand more about chemicals and chemical safety. It's important to be informed and aware of chemicals and chemical safety. The first and most important step is to stop and read the label. All the basic information you need to know is found on the label. It will tell you the name of the basic substance, what types of hazards there are, what it will do, what chemicals can't be mixed with this particular substance, and any emergency medical information you'll need to know. You'll also learn how to properly store, handle, and dispose of the material. Once you've read the label, you'll be able to identify the type of chemical and the proper instructions required for this chemical. Basically, there are four types of chemicals. Let's take a look at what they are. First, toxic agents. Now, these are chemicals that are poisonous to you and can act upon the body very rapidly. Hydrogen sulfide and cyanide are examples of toxic agents. Second, corrosives. This type of chemical is usually an irritant. Corrosives can damage your body by burning, scalding, or inflaming body tissues. Examples of corrosives are chlorine, hydrochloric acid, and, of course, battery acid. Third, flammables. Flammables are the chemicals that burn readily. They may explode or burn if sparks, flames, or other ignition sources are present. Examples are gasoline, benzene, and ethyl ether. And fourth, reactives. Reactive chemicals are those that require stability and careful handling. Some of them can explode or react violently if the container is dropped or hit. Other reactives may react violently if mixed improperly with other substances. Nitroglycerin is an example of a reactive chemical. No matter what type of chemicals you're using, you need to be aware of the ways that chemicals may affect you. If you're not properly protected, you may be exposed to chemical hazards. Here are the ways in which chemicals can enter your body. Inhalation. Chemical vapors, dust, or gases can be inhaled if you're not wearing a respirator or proper respiratory equipment. Two, absorption. Some chemicals can be absorbed right through your skin and into your body. You can prevent this hazard by wearing the appropriate gloves and protective clothing. Three, ingestion. You may be ingesting small doses of chemicals daily and not even realize it. Chemicals can be absorbed by food, cigarettes, and drinks. They can also remain on your skin and be transferred to your food if you don't wash your hands before eating. Always be sure to wash your hands before eating and make sure you store food away from your work area. And four, spillage. There's always a chance that you may be accidentally splashed or exposed to a chemical. To prevent injury, you should always wear the proper protective equipment according to company policy and the requirement of each specific chemical. Okay, let's review some basic safety tips about chemicals. First, read the label. It will tell you what you need to know about your chemical.